it's a sensational photo uh, for many reasons. One is the, uh, she has this young man with her who was a mystery up until just a few days ago. We didn't know who he was. Uh, and here's Diana lying kind of in, a, in an uncomfortable position with him. He's got a book leaning up against her. But the most remarkable thing about this photo is the photo editor at the Daily Mail or the Sunday Mail wrote on it not to be published. If you look on the back of this picture, it's dated 26 February 1981, which is two days after Buckingham Palace announces the engagement of Charles to Diana. And this is certainly not the image that Buckingham Palace would have wanted out on those two days. And uh, uh, most likely some kind of palace intrigue stopped this photo from being published. Um, and now it's kind of uh, out there after 30 years, and it's quite a sensation. millions of people wanted to know who was the gentleman in the photograph and they put the call out uh, in the British media who is this man and, and uh, the Guardian newspapers I think solved it and his name was Adam Russell and what's fantastic is he's the grandson of uh, Prime Minister Baldwin who we know very well at our auction company because he's always with uh, autographs of Neville Chamberlain and Winston Churchill. So a very famous English Prime Minister, his grandson, along with Diana Spencer, uh, at 19 or 20 years old, on a ski trip. Uh, mystery solved. W one of the highest sought after collectibles is Princess Diana material. And this is a one of a kind photo that captures that moment of when the fairy tale really began because of the date on the back. Uh, so it, Diana's fantastic and highly collectible.